Well, howdy doody. This is Mr. Handsome from the Nashville Wife blog. Uh, as you know, Ellie calls me Mr. Handsome for obvious reasons. Uh, I am going today to show you how to grill a nice burger. Um, it's a beautiful day outside. We got spring coming in. It's beautiful here in Tennessee, so let's get started. Most of you probably know how to grill already, but maybe there's some tricks here you want to know. Let's start with the buns. I like to make this as unhealthy as possible, so I've melted some butter. And I'm going to put butter on the buns, kind of Texas toast style. And I'm going to put some seasoning on. I've got a combination of just all natural sea salt, some Montreal steak seasoning, and some seasoned salt. But you can really use whatever type of flavorings you want. So there's the, the buns. I also just made some Texas toast to go with it. Put a little butter on that as well. Ellie has already made some vegetables, some green beans. She's put some olive oil in and some, some seasonings as well, whatever you like. These are frozen, but usually I do <laughs> them from fresh, but... We'll see how this goes. They're usually from fresh. Yeah. Now we have some Ellie's world famous homemade barbecue sauce. I'm gonna mix it in. I'm gonna put a little bit in to my burger patty. Um, and this is beef. It can be all natural grass fed, or it can just be whatever beef you can find. So you mix it in, that barbecue sauce will keep it moist and give it a little extra flavor. All right, let's head out to the grill next. All right, so we've got this grill going, nice and hot. We've got our vegetables, we got our Texas toast, and our burgers going. So I go at medium heat and just kind of flip them occasionally, make sure they're not getting too overdone. So notice we have our neighbor's cat. Well, we really, we really don't know whose cat this is, but every time we start cooking, he shows up. I'll go ahead and feed him a little extra leftovers from yesterday. Here you go, little kitty. And everybody's happy. Now the green beans have garlic salt on them, olive oil and garlic salt. I put them in a bowl and mix it all together and then grilling them tastes super good. So we'll show you everything when it's done. All right, here we are with the finished project, finished product. We got the burger here. I went ahead and put some uh, some cheese on it, some bacon, some barbecue sauce, and some onions. We've got our vegetables and our bread. Let's see how it tastes. Oh, oh, mm. that's horrible. My goodness. Whatever you do, don't try this recipe. This tastes terrible. No, I'm just kidding. I always want to do that. Tastes great. So go out and do some grilling. Signing off. Visit us at NashvilleWife.com.